Okay, let's talk to Jeffrey right now. Hi. Hmm. What got you in such a good mood? Hi, Jesse. I'm done working. And what are you doing? Nothing special, really. Haha, uh -huh, I see. You're probably collecting leads and clues. I'm actually doing that without noticing now. What do you want to know? Grab me. <laughs> I'm gonna say that. Hold on, I have to say bye to Richie real quick. Okay. Here we go. Or like, more like, here we go. Otherwise, he'll just get confused again because I just disappeared. So, I have a surprise for you. What? I have to say that I'm surprised indeed. Um, oh, well, I'm just gonna say I love surprises. Perfect. But it will take a little bit longer. I'm glad the weather is good today. And Richie was nice enough to let me leave a few minutes early, otherwise the surprise would not have worked. Great uncomfortable small talk. So I guess the surprise must be outside. Ha ha ha, King. Luckily, we will get there in a minute, or you might get, or you might guess it. I wonder how things will go with Lily from here on out. I bet you she is already planning her next attack. Please, let's not talk about, let's not talk about Lily. What do you mean by that? I bet you, I bet you she is already planning her next attack. I actually hope she is planning an apology. That will be great, but. So here we are. Welcome to Duskwood, historic forest area, Sunset Rocks. Ta da! You bought Duskwood for me? <laughs> Not what I expected, but okay, wow. Ha ha ha, no! I came up with the idea to take you on a walk with me, so I could show you Duskwood. I don't feel like getting a sightseeing tour. What? I thought that would make you happy. I don't have time, okay? Okay, well, that's kind of sad to be honest, but it's true though. Okay. Oh wow, Dan is really sending this to everyone, huh? She now sent it to Cleo. That's neither funny, nor do I have time for something like this. Tell him, Cleo, and don't send this to Thomas, please. That will be tight even for you. Oh my god, of course he sent it to me as well. I mean, I remember seeing that in the past, but whatever. Um, I'm gonna say not funny.
What the fuck? Nobody here has a sense of humor. <laughs> Lol. Norman added you. Let's see what you got here. I saw the video that Han's sister made. You're pretty early with this. Honestly, I don't know what should I say. Not again or. You're pretty early with this. Enough is enough. Oh, I can... I can write whatever I want now, huh? Is it possible that it looks familiar to you now? Remember we had talked about the bracelet before? I'm gonna say the first one. Yes, it does. I think it's yours, honestly. Wait, let me think. She's, she's going to say it's not hers now. Now I remember, I saw it in the window of the pawn shop. Yes, I'm absolutely sure. And are you going to tell me what's going on with this bracelet too? I will real soon, alright? I'm gonna say, unfortunately I can't do that. I feel I've had enough. Hold on for a second thing, my brother is texting me right now, okay? I just opened up the bar and who do I see on the video from my security camera? Your two friends. And I can't watch it. Come on now, that's disappointing. That's Cleo and Thomas, right? Yes, that's them. But what are they doing there? That's from the camera by the back door to the basement. Oh, so that's... They were probably just about to break in when I got there. Oh my gee. I totally don't have an explanation for that feel. They are either going to come here and tell me what this was all about, or I'm going to call the police. I'm on my way home, but I'm going to call them both as soon as I get there, okay? I'm telling you, Jesse, I'm fed up. I know, Phil, I'm really sorry this happened. There just has to be a good explanation for their behavior then they should better hurry up and start explaining. Oh man. You're not going to believe what my brother just told me. Clea and Thomas were going to break into the basement of, the, of his bar. Um. Don't say anything. King? That is unbelievable. And now once again you're caught in the middle. So what now? Oh, sorry. 
I thought I saw something in that back alley. Um, now I'm going to tell, uh, now I'm going to let those two know that they have to talk to Phil and explain what happened. Otherwise, he will call the police. But first, I want to get home so that I can take care of it from there. Um, I think someone is following her. They excluded us. What stirred in that basement? Was Phil ever acting suspicious? What stirred in that basement? That's Aurora storage cellar. Filler keeps drinks, spare chairs and stuff like that in it. So nothing exciting at all. What could they have wanted in there? Alcohol? I don't think they were looking for Hannah in there. You don't think they were looking for Hannah in there? Not at all. Was Phil ever acting suspicious? What do you mean in reference to Hannah? Yes. No, of course not. Are you saying that as his sister or as a neutral person? 100% 100% neutral they excluded us you're right and why well if they think Phil is a suspect then it makes sense that they wouldn't tell you anything then they are looking for Arians first But why wouldn't they tell you? If I know it, you know it too. They owe me an explanation on that. Because they know I would have been against it. I'm gonna say, if I know it, you know it too. Which is not true, to be honest, but... I'm just gonna cover it up by that, by saying that. Yeah, that makes sense. Hey, King. Is there a way we can talk on the phone? At least until I get home? I suddenly feel a little nervous somehow. You should have never been out all alone in the first place. Let's accept. Talking to me on the phone. I wanted to be home before it got dark. Oh man. Unbelievable that Leon and Thomas were going to break into the basement. I mean, what did those two think they were going to find? There isn't anything in there. And what if I would be unable to get a hold of them now? Does that mean Phil is seriously going to call the police? Damn, it would be the last thing we need. <laughs> I knew it. 
What a creepy face that was. I mean, that was a mask, but that was creepy, dude. And I knew it. Whoo! <laughs> I knew that would happen. I mean, since she started saying... From the moment she started saying that she thought she saw something in the back alley, I was like, something's gonna happen. And when she said um, that she's uh, getting nervous and she would like me to uh, call her, or like she would like to call me, I knew something's gonna happen. And then that happened, I knew it. But anyways, Honestly, I have a lot to say, but it's kind of late right now, and honestly, I'm kind of tired, so I'm just gonna end this video here. That was episode 5, we're definitely going to continue episode 6 real soon. So yeah, look forward to that, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already, and like this video, that really helps me out a lot. Also, click the notifications bell so that you get notified every time I upload. And I'll see you next time, I'm gonna talk about all this, probably in the next episode, um, but yeah, you could uh, comment down below if you'd like to discuss with me uh, anything about the game, who do you think the killer may be and why, um, I'd love to talk to you about that, it is, it, it's really interesting to see. Um, what do you think what's your aspects uh and yeah like it's good to see different opinions about that and how you see how what's your like point of view into all this mess basically um so i'm just gonna say that we solve this right now like I think I can tell that Jesse is not the one. Um, I mean, I would say, yeah, she's... She's not the man without a face, or what's his name, Indiana, I forgot. A man without a mask, or... No, a man without a face, right? So... I don't think it's Jake, but he could be, like, imagine the plot twist that it's Jake. Could you imagine? I could see it being possible. Could you imagine it's Jake? Could you imagine Lily's right? <laughs> I mean, at some, some part, like, she said that I'm involved. I mean, that I'm the kidnapper as well, but I'm not. But honestly, I don't know, like... I don't think that it is Jake, but it will be a really huge plot twist. I mean, it does make sense why... Why Jake will do that, why will he help me? Unless he would like to... Uh, place or like put all the blame on me so I don't know we'll see I'm as much as I'd like to rumble on now I'm kind of tired right now and I'm messing up my words right now so <laughs> I can't speak right now basically so I'll see you next time remember to put a smile on your face as always say it with me plus ultra Let's discuss about everything later. Bye-bye, guys. <laughs>